Hi guys, Mark Koenig here. Today we've got this 2017 BMW M240i and it has come in for an iDrive flash. So as you can see, if you jump in the car, now if you go into the iDrive, so it's got the iDrive 6 on there. And then if you go into navigation, settings, position version, you'll see it's got MBT Evo J. So MBT Evo J doesn't actually support uh, full screen CarPlay, which is what this customer wants. And you can't just go and update the firmware through like a USB stick or whatever. And he also doesn't have Apple CarPlay. So what we'll be doing is updating the iDrive firmware to the new iDrive uh, MBT Evo Y, the latest software version, and also activating full screen Apple CarPlay. Normally, um, he can just get CarPlay activated, but it'll be like a half screen version. So if I go into the map, so CarPlay will cover that side. What we're going to do, we're going to flash the new firmware on there, activate full screen Apple CarPlay, and show you guys how that look. Now, for that, we do need uh, inner OBD cable, which is what we've got here, Windows laptop, and we've also got a battery charger connected here. Um, as you can see, that's CTEC battery charger, all connected to the car. Um, if you guys are doing this at home, you can get yourself a battery charger, or if you want it just, an, just for an hour, you can get another car connected with jumper cables, that should work fine as well. The flash is all set up now, as you can see, these are all the modules that are in the car, and we're just going to be flashing the head unit. Uh, this customer does have a remap on his car. Uh, obviously, we're not flashing the engine ECU for um, so that the DME, so that'll make sure that his remap stays on the car as well, as well as getting full screen up the car play. So we'll just start the flash now. There you go, so that's starting the flash. And roughly, it takes around 40 minutes plus or minus for it to be fully flashed, and then we have to do the full screen car play activation and this and back recording. So once that is done, I'll come back and show you how it looks. Right guys, the update has now been finished. So if you look at the iDrive, so we're going to navigation, go down to settings and check the software version out. As you can see, it's on MBT Evo Y, so that's the latest software version from 2024 uh, July. And as you can see, the iDrive is working pretty much how it should. And now, if you're going to manage and connect new device, we've got Apple CarPlay and screen mirroring option on there as well. I've already paired up my phone, so the bottom left corner that's for Apple CarPlay. There you go, perfect. So that's full screen Apple CarPlay working on this 2017 BMW M240i. Your Google Maps, Waze, Spotify, YouTube Music, everything working just like it should. And obviously you can see how beautiful it looks on the interior of this car, completely transforms it. All your normal features such as the settings, uh, all of that stuff will stay normal. So you still have access to everything. And this is just a normal OEM software update so you don't lose any of your service history or you know no faults with this at all. So all of this stuff is still there. And then obviously if you go back into Apple CarPlay, that's the result. So yeah, if you guys need this doing, drop us a message or visit our website, matcoding.co.uk and we can sort this out for you. Thank you very much.